Hey guys, JD and Clifford here with our longtime friend and companion, OMG Card Poles. Hey everybody. And uh, here we go. We have something really different. Uh, OMG, you want to talk about this? Yeah, we have here a throwback 94 Flare inaugural edition of Marvel Universe. So many of you guys probably remember how amazing these cards were. They come in those gold slip out boxes. Uh, Marvel is starting to make a comeback. We have some new releases coming out. Uh, in February, so I thought why not dive into one of the most famous Marvel products of the 90s, this 94 Flare. And you're kicking it old school here. Um, so this, you were telling me all the old stuff is on, is on a rager. You know, Marvel is making a big push with their, with their content and the cards are starting to come back. Uh, it's kind of slowly been creeping up behind Yu-Gi-Oh! and Pokemon and Magic. Yep. And a lot of these 90s sets are becoming harder and harder to find. Uh, they're notoriously difficult to find in good condition. Uh, these boxes uh, tend to be, need to be stored properly. There was a lot of sticking back yeah, in the day. You kind of went out of your way to find this one. This took a couple of weeks to find these, but as we uh, go along and kind of wait for these new releases coming out, we're gonna start bringing in some of these cool products to throw back. And uh, I didn't think of any better way to do it than to head over to Toy Wiz and do it with the, you The nerds at Toy Wiz. And share it with you guys. So. Uh, what we'll do is we'll open it up, we'll each take a pack, open it up, and share some of these awesome 94 Flare Marvel cards. And uh, I think we'll also do a giveaway it's, as well, so... Sounds good to me. Anybody who likes or comments in this video on Toy Wiz's channel will be entered to win one of these 94 sealed packs, courtesy of the OMG Card Pool channel. Well, that's extraordinarily Love generous, it. and thank you. So, I will be very careful. I, I brought out a, a very sharp, very, very good knife to just get the plastic. Look at that, like a like a surgeon. To make so. you guys feel old, <laughs> I was three when this product came out. Oh my god, this was one of the first like non-sports products that I got. Uh, I remember my dad actually, uh, Flair had the same slip out cases for the sports cards, and yes. he brought these home, and I thought they were sports cards, right. and then I realized they weren't. They were Marvel, and you can see here these awesome. Wow. Slip cases. Like, it's really awesome. Yeah, signature slip case. Each one has a different character. You see, we got a couple of Venoms. We got the gold Wolverine. Yeah. Uh, Who's that? War Machine? I can't see from this angle, but just very cool stuff. Uh, I actually. Cyclops? Oh, Cyclops. Cyclops. Yep. Cyclops. There we go. All right. So, uh, well, OMG, you pull your first pack. All right. I'm going to go with Cyclops since I butchered him. So I'll take the Cyclops pack. All right. And uh, Clifford? I'm going to go with Venom. I like Venom. Well, you guys. Opened up a Magneto. How do I say no to that? All right, awesome. So, so let's close this back up. And remember, guys, if you comment below, you have a chance for a very generous OMG to win a pack of your very own. So what I'll do is I'll go first. And actually, if I can borrow oh. that sharp little knife, because these are very difficult to open. They are. So this is this is bringing back memories. Is Doctor Doom in this set at all? They had some really I awesome would cards think so. in this set. Uh, so there's. Uh, there's Power Blast cards, which are uh, one in every other pack. And there's an, there's definitely another Chase in here, right? Yeah, I know the Sparkle cards. I remember those. I think those are every other. Every other, and then there's a couple of other Chase cards as well. So I just got the wrapper off, That's your middle right and there. I'm gonna show you just how cool these really just fancy old school slip cases. Back in the day, you slip it out, and then you have the internal wrapper. And these are the 94 Flare cards. So if you remember from the early 90s Flare baseball set, the infamous A-Rod rookie card, same design from Flare with the nice slip case. Uh, just really gorgeous cards. And I saw right up top a Deathlock. You got a Deathlock to a, start. A character that I love that I think is terribly underutilized. And Marvel, if you're listening, would make a great series, an awesome series. I like the Deathlock. Oh, uh, loved it. So, all right, so it does, I'm feeling a little stick here, a little bit, but I think I think we'll be able to come out of here relatively unscathed, it's not bad. Again, you have that real nice gloss finish and they are very difficult to get in good quality and these are not too bad and there is that one is of the big hits right there. Sick. This is one of the harder cards to get, the Venom Lives card with Brock in the yep. back, just. The very McFarlane inspired Venom right awesome there. Awesome stuff there. Mephisto. Mephisto. Look That's at that. awesome. Just the artwork here is yeah. total 90s, just so awesome. Very airbrush, very popping. And though. this is another one of the Carnage. Yep. Carnage. He's going to be in the new movie. So, I mean. Yeah, that's. Um, who's playing? Woody Harrelson. Woody yeah, Harrelson, yeah, this is. Uh, 
you're gonna be looking for cards in this set, these are oh, the Oh, Moon Knight, he just that. got announced in series, and that's an awesome card. That is just so cool. Uh, so, the loss of Ilyana. So this is the, uh, the legacy virus storyline, right? Uh, right. Definitely uh, early 90s. You can tell by Jean Grey's hair. Awesome. Yes, classic Famous Hulk. classic Hulk cover. Very nice. Havoc in his uh, early X Factor uniform, I believe. Yeah. I gotta say, this, the quality of these cards, again, this is one of those things that always gives you kind of a heart attack. It's very difficult to get these where they're not sticking and put peeling yep. off the covers. Uh, the corners are really nice on these products, uh, on this product, and uh, we kind of lucked out here, guys. Oh, and there, there we go, is. the captain. That's how we. That's how we ended up. Cap versus cap. So that has to be him versus U.S. agent. Awesome. Yep. Versus the captain. That's yep. right. That's just an awesome card. I'm a giant Captain America nerd, so. So I, I, I think the Venom and Carnage, this middle row right here. Yeah, th this is the winning row right here. That's the winning row right there. Though, if Marvel's listening, Deathlock. <laughs> I would love to see a Deathlock right. series. So, all right, so that was the OMG pack we had. That is Clifford pretty excellent. Now. I got the wrapper off, off camera here, just to not interrupt your <laughs> That's all right. beautiful our, display. Our, our nerding out. There, it, takes, yeah. it takes 10 minutes to take off the wrap. So we're just buying time for each other. Crack this open. I really enjoy that slip packaging. That's super cool. That's yeah. You probably don't remember that because you were like a fetus. But yeah, that was uh, that was a thing at the time. That was this was big in the '90s. The slip packaging was where it was at, and that was again it. not just Marvel. It was those sports cards. That, the top that Daredevil in his '90s costume, which at the time everyone hated. Um, but I think time has been much kinder to it. It's an actually pretty cool design, though. The classic Daredevil yeah. red is hard yeah, to argue. We just, we just saw this card. This Quicksilver. One of the popular cards in this set. Quicksilver. Very cool. So, unfortunately, he didn't make it out of the MCU. He did not make it though, out of Though, I guess in the multiverse. Yeah, who knows? Boom Boom, uh, uh, who uh, was part of Liefeld's X-Men, uh, X-Force. I was gonna say, Force. this looks very Liefeld-y. Yeah, just, yep. X, yeah, we just, we're just checking this out. Sure, she throws basically energy grenades, if memory serves. Yeah, I know a little bit. Ooh, a Nova, and I gotta say, not a fan of that art. That is, uh, that's rough. Very aggressive yeah. on the, the muscles. <laughs> that's rough. Great character, though. Uh, Cla classic Spider-Man. Classic Spider -Man. right there, look at that. The wedding. MJ and Spider-Man, love that card. I'm glad you guys are here. <laughs> We got you. Uh, vengeance. Vengeance. That's, that's vengeance. actually a Ghost Rider villain. Um, it, again, very 90s right there. He's just Ghost Rider. He's like evil he's Ghost Rider. Evil Ghost. Bad Ghost Rider. Bad Ghost Rider. Na naughty Ghost Rider. Naughty. <laughs> uh, Punisher 2099. I have that cover. <laughs> it's one of the few comics I own. Yep, that is uh, very aggressive outfit. I it's awesome it. though. It's so oh. over the top. Uh, classic classic Spider-Man vs. Rhino. There you go. Classic, classic card. Love that. That was they teased Paul Giamatti as. Yeah, Rhino no, we don't we like don't talk about that. Second, right? That was that was not good. Nice. Here we go. We oh, got a Wolverine, Wolverine finally riding the subway. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know what he's doing. Wolverine just sad. Oh, on the it's I, it's uh it's Mariko after she's been killed. Oh, um, on the subway. Sad, I don't think it's a subway. Sad subway, right? <laughs> he realized he forgot his sandwich at home and yeah, he has to go yeah. to work. And nice. a Sentinel, that's cool. The Sentinel uh, getting blown up, what does that say? Days of Future Past, okay. It's probably the, the most line. popular X-Men storyline of all time. So we haven't hit one of the Shimmer cards yet, which are the big hits, so I think... Well, uh, it means I'm gonna have to do it. I, I think Dave's gonna have to do it, yeah. So I gotta say, your pack was significantly better than Clifford's. I, I, yeah. I think the, the Venom, I have the trifecta, Moon Knight, Venom, and Carnage, that's right. where you wanna be. All right, I'm putting the money on Magneto, JD. though. JD's gonna Go the villain. The hot well! Oh. I'll take that first one. I saw something on the back. Hold on, hold on. You might have our first Shimmer card. All right. And we're starting off. We're starting off with good old Scott Summer Cyclops, the leader of the X-Men, and uh, I think, Clifford, you chose that? Oh no, is this one we didn't choose as one of the uh, yeah. the pack covers? I took, I took Venom. Ooh, I have an upside down card. Oh, wait, they're all upside down? All right, the rest is this way. So, Iron Man is born, the classic Iron Man uh, cover. Yep. Uh, let's see, we got Spider-Man 2099, mm -hmm. which, uh... I like the 2099 stuff. It was fun. I mean, the Doom 2099 was my favorite. Classic rivalry. We got, uh, Wolverine versus, uh, Sabretooth. And then we got Deadly Enemies. Uh, 
What is this? Hulk 2099, I should have recognized that. He looks significantly more bestial. Yikes. I'm, I'm pulling a 2099. Uh, okay. You got the 2099, 2099 hot pack. Pack, yeah. uh, What's it? Body slide? Okay, that's what it calls when, uh, Cable calls it when he teleports. Body slide. Again, you can tell that You're getting this is all the futuristic. Yeah, yeah, based off of Liefeld art, you can tell because the gun makes zero sense. And no feet. No feet. No, no feet. <laughs> Classic Spider Man versus Vulture, who was played by Michael Keaton and was excellent, and I hope they bring him back. Wonder Man, who they've now made into a pacifist, and he doesn't fight anymore, which I don't, is don't understand kind of lame. Concept. Uh, Blue and Gold, the classic when they broke the X-Men down into two teams, uh, famously done by Jim Lee when he uh, relaunched the X-Men in the 90s with the, at the time, the largest selling book of all time with its gatefold covers and connecting covers. Very, very cool stuff. And Black Costume Spider-Man. So, so there is one correction here oh. because you actually did get a massive hit if you could turn that Cyclops around. Oh. I uh, I didn't realize. Get a little. Oh, as I almost dropped it. Oh, I did it. That is one of the uh, very difficult to find chase variants in look. the set. Believe it or not. Oh, look at that. Super yeah. cool. I win. That is pretty awesome that we got that. Um, that's a big hit. So very I, cool. I'm I, glad we. That's weird. I didn't see that it's on the opposite yeah, side. Yeah, I didn't see it. It's until, in really good condition too. Yeah, that's surprisingly. Yeah, the, uh, these difficult. cards are all been in great condition except this Iron Man. There's a nick there, but other than that. Yeah. You said no sticking or no anything? No stick, really? the sticking is minimal. Yeah. Usually the sticking will peel off the card behind it. It has not here. Uh, so that means this box was stored properly yep. and uh, that's what we try for. You know, we try to really do our research and get these cards to you in as good a shape as possible. Uh, we were happy to share it with you. So if you enjoyed these cards and you enjoyed the break, uh, please like and subscribe, drop a comment and we will randomly select someone who has uh, subscribed, liked or commented the Toy Wish channel to win one of these packs. Uh, we really appreciate it. As always, guys, thank you for inviting me over here to share these. Oh, thank, thank you. For Thanks for bringing over the cool yeah. stuff. Thank you for thinking of us. And um, all of OMG's socials and YouTube page will be in the description below. And you're going to be doing something with this product in our own channel. We are. We are going to be doing a showcase as well. You've seen a lot of these uh, unboxing videos hit the OMG channel over the last couple of months. So we will do a preview of a couple of these uh, landing by the end of the week. And for those of you who don't know, the OMG Card Pool channel will be back to breaking sports cards this Thursday for Throwback Thursday. Looking so forward to it. Don't forward miss forward it. I'll be in the room. There. All right, guys. All right. Well, thank you for watching, and we'll see you guys next time. Bye.